It's time for some fun Fred and Susie facts. Concrete. And you. <laughs> Concrete is a versatile building material used to build bridges, homes, roads, dams, office buildings, and other large structures. Concrete is a composite material that is made with cement, water, and various sized stones called aggregate. When wet, the concrete can be poured into forms to make walls or pavement, or into molds that make blocks, columns, and other shapes. When dry, the concrete has a hard, durable surface. Concrete was first used by the ancient Romans and is found in many Roman buildings, such as the Colosseum, which is nearly 2,000 years old. Concrete is also recyclable. Old concrete is crushed into small pieces and can be used in the place of gravel, or it can be used as aggregate mixed with cement and water to make new concrete. Friends of ours recently had a patio put in by professional concrete workers. Let's watch the process. Before the concrete can be mixed and poured, the space needs to be cleared of grass and loose dirt. Then the workers cover the ground with a bed of packed stone to support the concrete. The area must be graded so water doesn't pool on the surface when it rains. Next, the workers make forms to contain the concrete. These can be made from metal or strips of wood held into place with stakes. I love stakes. Unless it is reinforced, concrete can crack over time. Here the workmen lay down a metal mesh. They will pour the concrete over the mesh and it will be sealed inside once the concrete sets. With the forms, stones, and mesh in place, it's time for the concrete. Concrete is mixed at a concrete plant and loaded into a big truck with a tank on the back. The tank rotates as the truck drives from the plant to the construction site to keep the concrete mixed and prevent it from setting up too soon. Once the concrete truck arrives, the workmen transfer the concrete from the truck to the work site and pour it into the forms. Other workers use special tools to push the wet concrete into place. Concrete is very heavy, especially when it's wet, so you have to be really strong to be a concrete worker. When the form is filled, the workmen then level the surface using a large board. Once the surface is smooth, they then use brushes to brush the top, adding a natural texture so the concrete won't be slippery when it is wet. Concrete takes about four weeks to cure properly, but concrete actually continues to get harder as it ages. Wow, Susie, those guys did a great job making that patio. They sure did, and they worked very quickly, well, too. Hey, you know what I would say if they were actors, don't you? Do I really want to hear this? Huh. I'd say they'd given a solid performance. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Fred. And now you know all about concrete. Yep. <laughs> what kind of music do you listen to in a car with concrete wheels? Rock and roll, of course. <laughs> and now back to Fred and Susie. <laughs>